Hello subscribers and thank you so much for watching and if you haven't already please subscribe and help our channel to grow. This time on Sailing Intermission we switched out our chart plotter. And Karen's looking better than ever. We did some sanding. And of course some hot dancing. And we saw another rocket launch. We've decided to replace the Garmin 546. It's about 10 years old. Um, it wasn't really networked. It just had power running to it. It was a chart plotter. And uh, we've decided to replace it with a 7 inch more modern 2020 or 2021 Garmin chart plotter. And this is down below. So here we go. They had mounted the old Garmin on this kind of wedge board here that we're going to have to construct a new one. This one's too short. I guess I'll need an appropriate piece of wood. Will any of these work? Uh, let's see. Working wood. I need to make a new one of these for our more modern touchscreen garment. But it's wider, so I have to make a wider piece of wood. I'm going to cut them 45 degree angle. Let's see, I'll just do it like this. Yeah. Good safety call. Uh-huh. That doesn't look that straight. Did I already cut that one? Let's see. Are we ready? We are ready. That was a lousy cut. Well, I'm gonna do no it one will see it. <laughs> yeah, but I'll know it's there. I will too. There, let me do it. This, I'll have to make this one longer somewhere. There. Okay, here's try number two. I hate having to push this little button to pull the trigger. On this one, I need to go that way again. I believe. Expertly cut. <laughs> snicker, snicker. All right. Dusty there. Okay, moment of truth. Ta da. It's beautiful. Out with the old and in with the new. And I don't know if it matters. I was. I'm at it, you know, where this is the bottom. Uh, let me see. I see. These aren't exactly 45, so let's just go with this. I'm thinking something like. Okay. Ready to go. Maybe. <laughs> if I don't mess it up. Thinking something like this. And I 
one, I'm guessing it's pretty level. There. There we go. Of course, it's unfinished wood. But... Details. Mm -hmm. it's not hooked up, but details, details. There we go. I don't think so. It tilts too, so. Yeah. Voila. Right. I don't know. You think showing us installing that Garmin might be kind of boring? Well, it is real life. I see a lot of YouTube channels and stuff on how to install different instruments mm -hmm. and you know it's kind of um bbn diy boring but necessary <laughs> man where'd you come up with that just had a creative moment <laughs> <laughs> or not um but it's you know it's our life mm -hmm. I could bring it up. I looped it over. Is that too sloppy? I don't know. No. Versus coming down the other way. Well, I think if it came down the other way, you'd still see it. So you would. It doesn't matter if but you see it on top or the bottom. I think you from think this angle, more... it's better on the bottom. All right, switch it around. Slack. Okay. So I agree. Looks better. Makes your artistic talent. That sure doesn't seem like it. I'm going to give it a little help. can't get it in the hole. That doesn't sound like you. There we go. It slipped right in. The moment of truth. Hey, looking good. Yeah. It's touch screen. It's actually an echo map. You know, it's not a multi-function, but it it is in 2k we're kind of on the garmin network and i think we have some n183 and we need new charts i agree there we are yay look it found us we're being stalked by the GPS. I can't think of a better stalker. To go along with our Garmin 73 CV that installed below, 
We also have a brand new Garmin 1242 XSV, nice 12 inch screen, freshly installed. Very excited about that, it's hooked into the radar. Had to order a new cable to uh, connect our sonar box to it. But what a beautiful 12 inch screen. Isn't that my shirt? Dang, I've been caught. Actually, I'm getting ready to watch you sand. Oh man, I can think of some other stuff to do. There go those 69 coats of varnish. <laughs>